Hey guys, what's up? This is Jay Zan. We're back. We're now playing King Seal 2, which is King Seal 3 in Japan, but in US it's King Seal 2. This is by From Software. This is a game that um, was released many, many years ago, way before Dark Souls, by the same people who made Dark Souls. And this is the Dark Souls Origins series where I'm going through all of the all of the games prior to Dark Souls that were like Dark Souls by the developers of Dark Souls to kind of show the lineage of where it came from because people feel that the game is new and fresh and it's it's not which is a good thing because these games were fun for 20 years the first one came out in 94 then 95 the second one which was twice the file size and then this one is twice the file size of Kingsfield two or one that we just that we saw in the United States. This one is a lot more open world than the previous one and it's it has a lot more to it. It's it's not as based inside of a uh, main structure anymore. It's very large open world. And this is probably closer to what you would expect from a Dark Souls game because of the more open world feel that this has. So we're going to get into it. This is this is Kingsfield 2. This is what we saw in the United States. Um, okay, I was gonna say, so let me start. This is what we saw in the United States as Kingsfield 2. So we're gonna start a brand new game. If you want to see the first Kingsfield, I'll shut up. Five years after the last game we just finished in the plot, and the Moonlight Sword apparently is broken. So he, he for ten years, he used Lyle his carried the burden of being prince to a damn kingdom. Now old enough to understand the message etched in his mind forever, it's time he faced his destiny. All right, where where was I? Oh yeah, if you want to see the first two parts of this series, you can check on my page. Um, I did for I did King's Hill one, which was never released in in, in the United States. Uh, I did that one, and then I did King's Hill one, which was released in the United States. Or King's Seal 2. The power of the seal for which Alexander gave his life is growing weaker. The number of evil creatures is steadily growing larger. If we allow that to happen, the country will be enveloped by total darkness and your former father unleashes his power. Ten years of pent-up rage on this land. For the past ten years, since the fateful day of the seal, I've been watching you grow. I'm excited sometime and that I'm afraid. Damn, it's fast. Please take with you this final sword, the X Collector. I'm praying that your journey will be guided by the light. Or I Excelator. It's 
pretty cool looking sword. Okay, here we are. I got the the UI is nicer now. Um, let's see, we've got same equipment slots. Don't know about the magic yet. Okay, so you can check out your your combos now. Um, looks like the uh, magic power is individual instead of specific, like to your magic power and wisdom. Wisdom is probably your magic power now, and magic power is your specific magic levels. If I recall correctly, the magic levels up on use now by element. So I'll be uh, I might be grinding some magic later. All right, so let's see what else. We've got the good oldies. Okay, all right. So. Controls are the same, that's good. Ah, it's Leon Shore, this guy was in the, f in the last one. I saved his ass. He's, he's the, uh, that elf that I saved, uh, that gave me the, uh, darkness sword. The one with the, with the ghost grandma. And he actually had that mirror on the back of his house. I wonder if this area where I'm at is that area. It's just in a nicer thing. Nicer world. Alexander lost his magical power of light on the day they replaced the great seal on the castle. All his life force was put into the seal. Because you have the blood of King Alfred, you have inherited that power as well. The four magical powers have been exhausted to, to four archmages who have been waiting to endow them upon me. Must have four magical powers to obtain the Moonlight Sword, which can break the seal of the castle. The four archmages put the sword in the tomb of Alexander and sealed it so that none but the one with all four powers could open it. Besides these powers, you must also obtain the seals of Icarus. Icarus. The king must have given them to someone for safekeeping. I'll tell you about Icarus later. It's Icarus later. Just remember that you have the three seals of Icarus in order for you to fulfill your destiny. The X Collector will grow with you and increase its power just as you do. One day you'll need its power. When you have the three seals of Icarus, bring them along with this sword. Cool. I wonder if it levels up. Or if it's like... Upgraded. Different kind of swipe now. It's kind of an angle. So yeah, I'm looking forward to this. This is going to be fun. Looks like there's an herb over here. Or just some plants. Turn right is still kind of slow. Kingsfield style. Okay, was there... There's a road here. First thing I see is a freaking dragon crystal that I can't get to. Oh, Kingsfield. Is that an enemy? What the hell is that? Is that an enemy? Oh, it's a broken wagon. So yeah, this is already more open. There's actually sky. There's sky textures. It's a blood sky, I guess. This totally looks like an enemy. The fuck is that? Hello? Oh, it's a skeleton of an animal. Gross looking animal. Is that something I can get? I hear something back here. I gotta be careful. This game, this series likes to kick kill you immediately. And I haven't found any way to heal or save yet. So. So I'm not gonna. We'll go there in a minute. I want to make. Sh I want to look around before I get myself killed. That's probably too deep, and I might drown. I don't think you can swim in Dark Souls even. So I highly doubt that this has a swimming mechanic. I don't remember swimming around in Dark Souls. 
Wow, there's a lot of enemies. What's up, mushroom? Oh shit. That was a lot of damage. And I'm poisoned. Okay, I'm gonna use an antidote. Alright, mushroom, you're uh I'll leave you alone for now. Uh maybe when I'm stronger. I'll check that out. I think the antidote herb healed me. And I can stand on this wall. Alright, so this Well those look better. They don't look like watermelons anymore. One. Two. I like to count out the amount of hits these take so I know how and when to plan my strikes and how much damage I'm doing with weapons. Okay, well I got a healing herb so that's good. I don't know which way to go right now. I'm just kind of exploring at the moment. Looks like some kind of structure here. Any plants nearby? Doesn't seem like it. What's this? Got an earth herb. Uh, can I read that? Alright. In one night, 150 gold. Alright, so it's actually got like an in system now. That's a lot of money actually. Well, maybe it isn't, but... For the previous versions it is. But if I have no access to a fountain, then that is probably going to be actually kind of good. But I'll be careful. What's up? Hi, Lyle. Might have grown since last time your father stopped by. What's your hurry? Please don't leave. Don't leave so soon. I've I haven't had a guest here in months, and and I'd love to hear you how you've been. I only charge you 150 gold, okay? I don't have 150 gold. You have anything else? I'll talk to you though. You got some more info for me? Anything else to say? Stand up, Lyle. Or no, I'm Lyle. Ed has been taking good care of your mother's tomb. He's a good man, Lyle. He knows more about the old cemetery than anyone. I think that he even knows of a passage to the back of the cemetery. Perhaps I'll open it for you. Okay, well, maybe I'll talk to him. Ed has been taking good care of your mother's tomb. He's a good man, Lyle. He knows about... Oh, it's the same thing. Okay, well, I, I highly doubt there's going to be secrets in this room. But let's take a look anyway. These games are ripe with secrets. They're everywhere. From good to bad secrets. Where you find a secret wall and there's spikes that come flying out at you. Or you find a secret wall and you get a new piece of treasure. Which is more frequent than the latter. Alright. It's locked. It's back there. I like how there's a little gate so you can look in. Is that the graveyard? It's pretty good music, actually. I kinda like it. The music's only getting better. I'm not worried about skeletons jumping out of me at this point in the game. Sounds like someone's cutting wood or something. I'm gonna kill this plant and then I'll check that house. Oh shit. Well that's pretty cool. I wasn't I really wasn't expecting that. Who lives here? Jack Lennon Leninger. Oh. He, he's tapping his cane on the ground. Hi, Jack. So the time has finally come to go to the castle? You must be very careful. Your father will be watching. And boy, he's gonna be mad. Uh, you aren't just late for dinner this time. 
I don't know if I mentioned this before, but the defense wall of Severia on the north side was built and garrisoned about six years ago. We can be safe today thanks to their work. The other side of the wall is called the Old Battlefield. Not nearly as old as I am, though. That's where the garrison used to fight off the invading monsters. Hardly a garrison at all. I guess they weren't really trained. They were just a bunch of ragtag soldiers on some idealistic crusade, trying to desperately save their lands and homes. I don't want to think about it anymore. I've been living here for 150 years now. Or is it 90? This guy wants to be an elf. Heck, I can't even remember. Anyway, I've never had a bit of trouble in this house. I used to be a baker at the castle, you know. But I never did find that recipe I was looking for. It was... Recipe... Pies! Huh. Okay, so yeah. Do I need to find you a pie recipe? Will you make me a pie if I find you a recipe? Let's look in your bed. You have any money stashed under there? Tapping into sleep now. Alright, I'll fight this plant too. This one's over here dancing. Oh shit. Gotta hit his stock. Can I read this sign from this side? No. Can I read this sign at all? Okay. This is Quist, the sacred land of the High Elves. So this must be an elf, High Elf town? Alright, I'm getting a lot better at controlling my character now than, say, when I first played Kingsfield 2. Oh, poor corpse. If this is uh, open, I'm not going that way yet. I'm going to continue. I want to look at this village first. Look through this village. Check out that statue too in a minute. There's that dragon crystal at the very beginning. That little path I saw on the other side of this structure going into the mountain is probably probably the way in. Right now I'm checking to see if I can get into that statue. Oh, here it is. What's that star all about? Statue of the Hero. I probably need some kind of a star or something or other. Star key or star seal or something. Sealed, yeah, probably some kind of statue. Here, it's gonna say something of the hero. I gotta remember that's there. Is this a safe spot? Yeah, it's a safe spot. Okay. All right, we'll save right here. Well, that's good. We now have a safe spot. We don't have to start from the beginning again. Let's finish exploring this village, and then we'll check out that pathway that we saw not long ago. This is pretty fun. Not surprised, I enjoy every one of their games. I haven't really played a bad From Software game, to be honest. They also developed 3D game, 3D dot game heroes, which I really thought was fun. I could see how a lot of people wouldn't nowadays, because it's really old fashioned style of gameplay, very much like the old Zelda games, but I really enjoyed that game. Let's out, out maneuver these plants. Anything in these graves? Just tombstone, tombstone. Lots of plants. Two. Three hits, for sure. I wonder if it like grows and stuff, this weapon. Or if it just gets stronger and like becomes like a great sword or something. Oh, I hit it, but it, holy crap, that knocked me back far. Didn't do much damage, but they do poison, I think. 
Oh, that one's stronger. That one took four. I need to get better at swinging this weapon. It's got a very small range. Let's go stamina. Okay. It's back here. Don't know if that's a new area. Oh, okay. I know where I'm at. I'm gonna fight this mushroom again. I'm gonna let it shoot its little spore cloud first, though. Waiting for my stamina to return. Okay. That seems to be the way I can do it. Hit it and sprint back, except I gotta wait for my stamina to come back when I do that. Shit! And I'm poisoned, I bet. I'll just use a healing item when I get lower. Just waiting for it to... Oh shit. Alright, I'm gonna use it. I would have so died if I didn't. Fuck you. Alright, I'll use another healing herb when it gets lower. This is kind of a faster one. One. I'm watching my health like a hawk right now. A hawk with depleting life. I'm watching it like that. Hey, a helmet. Let's use it. Another helmet? I wonder if there's like a full set of leather in this area. Like, in this first town area. Four health. Okay. Can I get through here? Can I attack these trees out of the way? I wonder how long, I wonder how much damage the poison does. I'm gonna see if I can get back there. It might be that, uh, that one locked gate. Oh no. Alright, well let me see if there's a secret door here. It might be that well also. I'm, right now, I'm just checking for secrets. Uh, nothing on that wall. Just gotta make sure I'm not gonna walk off into the river. And die. Huh, I wonder how I get in there. Maybe the other way. Oh, here we go. <sighs> Damn those mushrooms. There's an antidote, and I'm not poisoned anymore, so that's good. There's probably an efficient way to kill those mushrooms without getting poisoned. Fight him in a minute, I want to see what's back here. Anything on that corpse? Got a bloodstone. Don't know if that cures uh, paralysis in this one, but it did in the other one. In Kingsfield 2. Alright, I'm gonna go fight those mushrooms. I think. Let me make a, a quick look over here. Okay. It's like some kind of a trench. Yeah. Alright. Let's see. And I know they're guarding a herb. I saw them. A couple, couple antidote herbs. Wonder how. Okay. Wonder how fast it attacks with that ability. Ah, oh, damn it. I so didn't think I was close enough for that. Oh, 
Okay, one health. Oh shit, a dragon crystal. Thing had a dragon crystal on it. Alright, spit your poison. I don't think I have to sprint backwards after I attack, because he gets stunned a little bit. Oh. But, they cast quick sometimes. <sighs> Alright, well... <sighs> Alright, well I got the Dragon Crystal. That's a good later game item. Right now, <laughs> not not such a good item, but later it's a great item because what it what it does in Kingsfield two and one is it heals your health to full and your mana also to full. So when you have a lot and these earth herbs are like healing for crap. All right, I gotta wait for him to use his mushroom poison thing, and that's like an instant poison. Do I have an offensive spell? No. How does that hit me? Crap. Oh, oh no. All right, I was gonna say, oh no, I don't have a. Oh, my stamina was down. God, those mushrooms are hard. Like, yeah, those would be way easier once I get some kind of offensive spell. Plus, I think... I don't think I'm supposed to be back here yet. I think this stuff's a little too high level for me. At level 1 still. See, I'm not even staggering these spiders. At least I've got my fancy footwork down. 5 hits. A little bit of gold. Not fighting you, I don't have the herbs for that. There's a church over here. Or what appears to be a church. Oh shit, fuck, 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 fuck. Ah. Uh, open up, open up. Oh god. Oh my god, that was scary. I had a few, you know, I, as I was opening that, I was like, I bet this is a skeleton. Oh, that would have killed me in one hit. I need to go back in there, though, at some point. And fight that skeleton, because it probably has... That was really terrifying. It probably has something good on it. What the hell is that? Okay, so ch chests are trapped also. Uh, this game's way more brutal. How many herbs? I have two herbs. I'm poisoned again. I don't want to use antidote yet. I can go around this wall. Is there any reason to, though? Wait, can I go on that wall? No. Okay, I'm gonna sprint by this mushroom. Okay, it didn't hit me, that's good. Um, probably gonna... Oh. Alright then. Let's, let's look over here first before I go back into there to fight that skeleton. Hopefully my health recovers a bit. Maybe these will drop a healing herb. Six health, alright. So I'm dead if I get hit. I'm gonna use an herb. This game is tough. Alright, let's go for the back one. Stop going so fast. Alright, this one's just about dead also. 
Good, I needed that really bad. They're not jumping spiders, at least. They look like a jumping spiders, but they're not. Did I check back here in the corner? All right, we'll we'll fight through this cave. I'm probably near level two, two twenty-five. Oh, I'm level four already. I don't remember getting level up messages. There's three spiders. I'm gonna run past them. Oh. Broken healing fountain. What a tease. Maybe there's a way to fix it. Might be like the first one where you have to do a couple steps to fix it. I do want to fight all these mushrooms. I just don't have the healing ability to do so right now. This torch is telling me there's an entrance here. Is this the graveyard? It's in here. It's like a freaking treasure room. The Queen of Verdite. Okay. Just looking at all the tombstones in case something's there. I was going to say, that's totally the emblem. Okay, locked chest. Two locked chests by the Queen of Verdite. Tomb. Sounds like just a secret. I hear it. Okay. Wow. If that doesn't require... What is all that noise? There's totally a scale. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Ugh. I knew that guy was there. Um, it's probably locked, but it might not be. But I can't handle one hit with, with my current armor, I don't think. Alright, sounds like there's another one. I don't think that can come through this door. Can I, can I trick it? Got a cool shield. I'm not sure. I'm trying to determine if the AI is better in, in this one than it was in the first one. Alright, I'm gonna try for it. Alright, got a crystal flask. Now I gotta try and not get killed. Shit, I'm so scared right now. Oh, I'm not staggering them either. Oh my god, this is so scary. Shit, shit, shit. Oh god. I uh, think I just urinated myself. Oh god, I did it! I, fuck, I killed it. I mean, it was just a skeleton, but still. <laughs> Alright, let me open this before I check for that other skeleton that I heard. It's right there. Alright, well the crystal flask, I should be able to fill with uh, water from a fountain when that becomes possible. Alright, so there's another skeleton nearby that's screaming and shit. Unless it was the same one. Could be possible, I guess, but I doubt it. I don't hear the, the other one anymore, though. Can I open? What's that? Probably a better healing potion. If if I can guess right. Alright, there's another door to some some direction. Alright, so there's that locked ass that room with at, by the Queen of Verdite. I I'm gonna try and fight this. Going in. That was close. Just 
to wait for the shoot its spores. It doesn't really seem to matter because they shoot so fast. It's kind of just luck. Ooh, that was, that's pretty good. That was a lot of money. These mushrooms are dropping really good starter items. All right, so I th actually, I think the episode's getting a little long. So thanks guys for watching. This is Jay Zan. This is Kingsfield 2. If you want to keep watching, do so. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. We're gonna, we'll see you next time.